Hello there, dreamers. Welcome to Disney Dreamlight Valley. Hi, Dara. Hi, Miss Cupcake. Hi, Tiffany. Hi, Flame G. Hi, everybody. Welcome. Big day today. Big day today. The most anticipated feature in Dreamers Portal just went live today. And my god, it turned out so much better than I thought. Well, at least that's what I think. Let me know in the comments if you had a chance to check out the new uh, Dream Snap Gallery. Let me know what, you, what are your thoughts. <clears throat> Thank you, Melissa. Hi, Rain. Hi, Amy. Hi, Gio. Hi, Varad. Welcome, guys. We're going to be checking out some uh, some stuff later during the stream. Going to be building the storage system. Would there be an option to follow people? Yes. Yes, there will be. That's the next step. In the next update, uh, we're going to have uh, likes and comments for the dream snaps. And uh, soon after that, we're going to have following people, messaging people, and stuff like that. So... But the core has been done. The Dream Snap library. That was initially the main feature. <clears throat> the main feature of Dreamer's Portal. But it can be so much more than that, though. Definitely need a new storage system. Yep. Need to redesign it from ground up. I'm tired of... Not being able to store my items in the right chests. And I'm thinking where to make it. Because I want to turn my plaza into the city. So I don't want to have my storage system in the plaza. So maybe I'll move it into uh, into Sunlit Plateau. I feel like Sunlit Plateau is a, the best possible... Uh, the best possible place to have a storage system. Because I have the least ideas for decorating that area. And also you can make it like a market looking thing which is gonna look super good in sunlit plateau so i think that's what we're gonna do <clears throat> build a ginormous storage system in sunlit plateau <laughs> storage today for real i mean that's the plan we did the star path so now can finally focus on the storage Mr. Star, I'm addicted to the Dreamers portal. I've been uploading like crazy mad lady. I've checked out your profile today. You have uploaded a lot of things. I'm glad you're enjoying it, Miss Cupcake. <clears throat> I managed to upload all my Dream Snaps yesterday, apparently just in time. Perfect timing. I need to bring the Scrooge store back. Yeah, I think we need this extra stream for Distant Dreamlet Valley so I can finally do some work. Some decorating, some... some improvements around my valley, because otherwise I just don't have much free time for it. <clears throat> Remember, money. Come on, I just want one new item. Wow, it's been a while. I refreshed twice and still not a single new item. <clears throat> Usually it's not as bad. Ooh, what's with my voice today? <clears throat> Mine are all indoors. Really? Interesting. I'm down to one wallpaper. Congratulations, Melissa. I had my storage so nice and organized, and then Eternity Isle messed it all up. Exactly, that's what happened to me too. So much new stuff, and then you start putting it in random chests, and then your random chests are overflowing, it's so messy. Yeah, we're gonna... I'm gonna build it with future expansions in mind, so I want to dedicate a huge space to it. And I want to move uh, Beast Flower Shop, I want to move uh, Moana's Boat close to it. I actually like where my Beast Flower Shop is right now. But I kind of like having all of the places that, uh, like, you can just grab the items from there and then put it straight into your storage system. 
I think I think for convenience factor it's gonna be worth it, even though it might not make sense to have Moana's boat in Sunlit Plateau. Unless I put it near the river, which I think I will. <laughs> My valley's a lot of chests with random stuff. It's a mess. Yep, welcome to the club. I'm in the middle of making my house into a storage system, decorating the main rooms and having chest fridges and wardrobes in the side rooms. That's awesome, DB. I just realized something. I may not even have enough chests. I, I might have to do another stream. Oh, <gasps> new table. Let's go. Exciting. Look at this table, Miss Cupcake. I know you have words to say about this table, but it's new, which makes it special. Oh, two new items. It must be Christmas today. Alright. Done with this. Let's go find a place. Oh wait, first of all, let's find blue chests. I haven't I completely forgot about blue chests. I haven't been looking for them for for a long time. I'm gonna need your help for that. <laughs> it's just a table. It has a red dot. That red dot makes it ultra special. I kind of like how the flower shop fits in here, but I feel like when it's there, I never collect from it because it's like, it's so far away from everything. And I just, I just don't feel like walking there every time. Maybe I'll bring it back once I like get all the flowers that I need. Once I fill up all my chests again. Hmm. Oh, I found a blue chest. That's a weird spot for it, but I'll take it. The red dots are our friends. Remember the times when we didn't have red dots? Wasn't that crazy? How did we even live back then? Also, let me know if the the music volume in the game is too loud. I can I can tone it down a bit. Comments, that's going to be a lot. I might just start from where we are. Uh, what do you mean, Melissa? Yeah, the, the lack of red dot is the reason why so many people want an option to sell stuff back to Scrooge. Honestly, if they let us sell stuff at a discounted prices back, I feel like Scrooge is not going to mind it at all. He's just going to be making fat margins on those sellbacks. So from my experience, if the first chest was in... On, on the main island, then the rest of the chests are going to spawn on the main island as well. So it has to be somewhere here. Maybe my experience is incorrect. Yeah, I don't see it. Has to be an eternity tile then. Unless it's spawned, like, somewhere in between things that I will never find it again. Yeah, we definitely need an option to see where the chests are. At least knowing which biome it is. Because now we have, like, 20 biomes in total. And it's... It's just too difficult. Well, let's take this down while I'm here. Because this is where my storage system is going to go. I think it's going to take, like, this whole area. Like, this whole giant area is going to be one big market slash storage system. It's going to look glorious. Or maybe I'll make it like this. I don't want it to be too far. I want it to be walkable from the main hub. So I think like like this, like this will make the most sense. 
Maybe under the trees. Yep, that's usually where it is. Under the trees, between the items where there's literally no way to see it from, from above. I find so many chests in these places. Let's clean this up. Also, I want to use a lot of those wooden uh, tropical wood flooring. It's going to cover my entire storage system. I'm going for like more of a natural look. This time. And I'm going to make everything. Everything related to storage is going to be here. Uh, all, all my auto cooker set up. All of the buildings that can give me stuff. Except Remy. I, I don't think there's a point of putting Remy in the in, in the Sunlit Plateau. I guess I'll just keep some chests near Remy's so I can stock up on souffle ingredients. Wally's garden is coming here as well. Sorry, Wally, but I need to start collecting some vegetables and I'm just not running around the valley with all the stuff. Okay, that should be enough space. Queenie, thank you so much for being a member for 11 months. So close to a year. Love, love the Dreamlight family. Thank you so much for support. Red badge is coming very soon. And we love having you as part of the community as well. <clears throat> yep, let's clean all of this up. And then I exit the furniture mode and it's all back. And it's going to be very, very fun. What do you think the new Dream Snap will be? Well, I can tell you exactly what the new Dream Snap will be as soon as I see the next week premium shop. They, 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 they've been doing this for a while. The, the Dream Snap theme corresponds to what item they have in the premium shop. But for now, I can only guess. Next Dream Snap is Moana's Village. Yeah, I've seen some leaks in, on the on the internet. Moana's Village. I haven't used Moana in, in my Dream Snap forever. Wait, do I have to build an entire village? Oh, no. And it's going to be a furniture challenge. Okay, that's going to be fun, actually. I need a good place for Moana. Probably going to be on the beach. And I've seen so many cool uh, photos, people sharing their valleys. They already have such a cool spots for their Moana's place. You guys don't even have to do anything. You just take a photo of it. Okay, we're going to go check out Eternity Isle. Maybe the chest is there. They should do it for more characters. Like it's it's such a good idea to have stuff like uh, like an area dedicated to a certain character. Lily McAllister, thank you so much for becoming Dreamlight Villager. All right, this calls for kitties. Welcome to the club. Thank you so much. All right, let's find those chests. I need to build a storage system. But also I wanted to show off some some of the new features on Dreamers Portal. Yeah, it it, it has to be stuck somewhere that it's not even going to be visible. <laughs> My whole valley is just <coughs> 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 Whew, what what is going on with my throat today? I thought it was getting better. <clears throat> my whole v village is like random dream snap uh, spots. With like collection of random stuff in it.
Yeah, I guess it's just it's in the in, it's in the other place. I just didn't find it. I did find the green chest though. Let's go get it. Sometimes green chests prevent blue chests from spawning. I don't know. It's just my observation. It might be completely false, but I feel like it happened to me before. As soon as I open green chest, I find the blue chest right away. Open! <clears throat> there was a moonstone chest by the tree. Under the tree by Scrooge store. Oh, okay. Okay. It's definitely... Oh, see? That's what I said. It wasn't there before. As soon as I opened the green chest, this thing spawned. That's awesome. <clears throat> Unless it was. Wait, was it there before? Oh, th is that the tree you're talking about? Okay, I guess I'm blind then. <laughs> Let's check out the Scrooge. Is there another one? Perhaps you Scrooge store. Yeah, I don't, I don't think there's any chests here. Jillian, thank you so much for being a member for four months. Let's go on the road to the Golden Mickey. <clears throat> I added comments to most of my submissions. I love being able to explain what I was going for or complain that I got robbed. Yep, that's what the comments are exactly for. There is a separate comment for submission and for result just for this occasion. Okay, final chest. Let's find it, and then we're going to check out Dreamer's Portal. And then we're going to do some decorating. Okay, I found another green chest. I don't care about green chests. I need blue chests. Hmm. Am I am I being blind again? It has to be here. Unless it's not. Then it will be somewhere else. Okay, fine. Scrooge store was down below before. Oh yeah, you meant like the the default spot for Scrooge store. Yeah, makes sense. I hate finding these moonstone chests. Yeah, I know, right? And why don't you open your gold chest? I don't know, just a habit. Maybe one day I'll do a stream when I refresh all of my Dream Snap rewards. Even though I feel like with the new Scrooge store, it's not... Like, it's no longer necessary. You get all the good stuff anyway, pretty quickly. Unless you are... Like, you have a lot of free time and you're targeting a specific item... But then I feel like refreshing Scrooge Store in this case is still more like more beneficial because the Scrooge Store is now huge. So you have much higher chance of getting an item you're looking for from the Scrooge Store versus the, the red chest. Because it's equally easy or difficult to refresh either. So I guess, I guess yeah, the, the Scrooge Store update killed uh, reward chest refreshes kind of. Unless you want to get multiple items per day. Yeah, I don't know where the final chest is. Maybe I'll find it randomly. Yeah, I saw the green chest. I, I was too lazy to go there. I, I was hoping that the blue chest would spawn anyway, but maybe it didn't. I will look for them on Thursday. Anyway. <clears throat> Let me show you a couple things. Just a giant plop of cat hair in my microphone normal stuff here <clears throat> oh boy that's loud all right let's do this <clears throat> just a quick plug also maybe i'll upload a couple results as well
Introducing Dreamers Portal. In case you guys haven't seen it yet, the link is in the pinned comments. This is, as it says now, the, uh, it's an ultimate haven for cozy gamers with a focus on distant Dreamlight Valley. Explore our vibrant community and discover the magic within our Dream Snaps library. Join us on this enchanting journey and start gaming with fellow dreamers today. So yeah, I, I just redesigned the homepage a little bit. I don't know. It seemed like it needed a little refresh, maybe a little bit more text. Let me know if you like the new design or do you prefer the old one? Yep, that's the Stardew music. Hi, Enigma. <clears throat> okay, so check out this new page. If you click on Dream Snaps, we have a Dream Snaps library. This is the place where all of those 12,000 Dream Snaps are stored. And you can show them in any way you possibly can. I did find one bug already. And it's the bug with the way the pictures are cropped when put into the frame. It is not fully centered. I'm aware I, I will fix it as soon as I can. But I, I don't think it, it makes it look super bad. Uh, so you, you can browse all of them. Or you can... Uh, I, I made a couple uh, presets. If you want to just look at a specific set of Dream Snaps. For example, if you're looking for the inspiration for the current challenge. This will change every single week. As soon as we have a new theme, this is going to change to the current week inspiration. The second preset is going to change to whatever week results we just got. Uh, this one you can see recently added Dream Snaps in case you want to see what's what's been uploaded to the website literally right now. Um, and if you want to see some of the best submissions with the best results, you can go for top 10, top 100, top 1000. But these are just presets. You actually have controls over everything. So you could technically replicate any of these using the filters. And I tried to make it uh, to be as responsive as possible. So if you're on the phone, it's going to look like this. You're going to have uh, a button here where, which you can click and it's going to pop out the filter menu. Uh... Yeah, pretty much the same thing, but I, I feel like the best way to enjoy the Dream Snap library is definitely on a big screen. <clears throat> you can sort it by random in case you just just curious, just want to see a bunch of random images from the library. You can sort it by the challenge, by rank, reward, score, date, anything you want. Also, if you're curious to explore the tag data, if you are if you're a believer that the tags do matter for your results. And you're curious what tags people had who uh, scored certain results. You can filter by tags, and it's only going to show you the images that have tags. You can also choose which which information you want to see in the gallery. So if you want to actually see the tags, you can click here. And it's going to show all the tag data that we have for this Dream Snap. You can also show uh, reward and rank. And make sure to only filter by the Dream Snaps that actually have results uploaded. You can click all has results. So this way you can see all of the results. And let's say you want to see for specific challenge. Uh, let's see. Let's go for Chill Summer. So now I'm I'm looking at all Chill Summer submission that had results submitted and had the tech data submitted. So, and also I can sort them by rank. And let's sort them by the top rank. There we go. Here they all are. Yeah, the possibilities of how you can filter and sort the data are endless. Hi, Jimmy. Drink some hot lemon water with a big scoop of honey. <laughs> or some bourbon. <clears throat> I actually sleep pretty well today, so I should be fine. I think it's allergies. I think I'm I'm allergic to something. Uh, what else was new? Oh, I guess that's these are the biggest changes. There were a few bug fixes, but yeah, n nothing major. If you guys find any bugs, so there's still a few errors I can see in the logs that are occurring very rarely, like literally maybe once every couple of days, somebody will get a certain error, which I cannot pin pinpoint. 
what exactly causing the error. So if you had any kind of behavior that did not seem like it was meant to be, or if you had any kind of error displayed on the screen, please reach out because I'm trying to fix that issue and it's bothering me, but I can't figure out what causes it. So I need somebody who actually encounters the error to reach out to d describe exactly what you did when you saw the error. Also, uh, I, I forgot to add uh, the last two fields. So right now the platform and date, they don't work. So they don't actually show you these da this data. I will fix it in the next patch update. So it displays the data as well. As, as long as you're not allergic to the kitties. I don't think so. <clears throat> I can't find mine either. Wait, what happened? Oh, you mean, okay, you, you, yeah, we're, we're also working on the page uh, with detailed instructions on how to upload your dream snap straight from your game uh, to the portal for every platform. So that's going to be coming out soon as well. <clears throat> Sometimes I get a blank picture when scrolling, but then I go back and it's fine. So I don't report it. Huh. By blank picture, you mean you have like a loading animation, or is it is it just like a white or black screen? So yeah, let's upload a couple of results because I'm almost done with my library. I just need to upload a few things. I need results for Camp Dreamlight, something wicked. Yeah, let me go into the game and take screenshots of those results so I can finally fully finish my library. I hope I can find them because my results are all jumbled up. Okay, Camp Dreamlight. I don't know, it's not sorted at all. It's in completely random order, I don't know how. Something wicked results. What else do I need? Aren't they still in your inbox? They are, but they're r sorted in, in some random order, so it's kind of hard to find them sometimes. When I upload a picture of the result, the picture actually doesn't show when scrolling through my gallery. Uh, the picture of your results is not showing through the... No, it, it, it will not show up in the gallery, but if you want to see it, you can click on the name of the Dream Snap, for example. Uh, like if you go... If you click on the name, like here, it's going to open up a whole page with the details of your dream snap. So here it would it would show you the for example if I click on this, you can you can see both pictures on the page. But for the most part this image doesn't get shown much because well we have we have all the data inputted. So this is mostly just so you can verify that the data was correct. For example, there, there is a few uh, there's a few dream snaps that I found that that had a little typo in in uh, when you inputted information so maybe you can check uh check and and fix if you can if you sort for example by rank uh and show let's say rank reward uh wait how do i find this okay here we go so like for example there's rank 4 4 i'm pretty sure the person just typed uh, an extra zero by mistake or here like if you if you if you actually look at the submission it says 337708 but the actual result was basically like an an, an extra digit type by by mistake so yeah we're going to have to add some uh, ability to edit this stuff like from the moderation team because some typos should be pretty easy to fix 
I had to recreate my first three. Thankfully, they were easy and awful. <laughs> That's the spirit. Like, how do you even remember? I don't even... If I didn't have the photos, I wouldn't even remember my first dream snaps. Swashbuckle and swagger. Frightfully festive. This one... Rightfully festive, done. Critter Love, Dreamy Kitchen. Dreamy Kitchen. Uh, forget me not. Earth and air. One second. Just need to take all the screenshots. And the final two, Ocean Views and Dreamlight Bowl. Like, for example, for me, Ocean Views and Dreamlight Bowl are literally on the top of my list. I don't know why. And I also... I will have to do this for my second account at some point as well. Wait, I don't even see my Dreamlight Bowl submission. Oh, I found it. Okay. Okay. Got all the results ready. The only one I did in screenshot was the first snub. I had uploaded on someone's Discord, but they revamp revamped their channels and erased everyone's posts. Yeah, if that was that long ago, I feel like it, it would get erased no matter what. I think there's a limit of on how much time Discord keeps the images or posts. Sometimes it shows the characters as home. When you go see the house, no one is there. Yeah, that, that happens sometimes. That's true. I'm missing random pictures and results, so it is what it is. Wait, what do you mean missing? Like, are you saying it's a bug? Or missing in terms that you can't find them? Well, let's see if we can find Dara. I mean, it looks, it looks like everything is working. <laughs> is this the Stardew Mermaid music? Yep, that's the Stardew playlist. So, Dara, what is this the reference for? I, I, I've been trying to think. It looks amazing, but I'm just curious. First of all, great idea with using the fire hat and three fires. That just looks like they're your children. <clears throat> Oh yeah, the results are all should be in the mailbox. But yeah, submissions you had to save manually in order to have them. So yeah, guys, if you find any bugs or anything like at all, like even the smallest detail, if you could submit it using the feedback feature on the website, you can click on your avatar and here leave feedback and you can describe your issue or you can use the Discord channel. We also have a Dreamers Portal bug uh, bug reports there would be very helpful so we can try to squash as many bugs as possible because some things even though it might seem small it can lead to discovering a bigger issue that could affect even more people so any bug is useful <clears throat> all right let's do this let's finish my uh let's finish my collection camp dreamlight let's upload the results
Let's go. I have also found today a profile that had like half of their images as black screen. And I was curious, is that a bug? Like, how does that even happen? So, so, so the person had a gallery, but half of the gallery was just black images, not just for submissions, but also for results. Did that ever happen to you when you upload an image and it just turns like a black, completely black rectangle? I'm curious how common this issue is. And if it's an issue at all, maybe somebody just decided to upload a bunch of black rectangles, who knows? <laughs> I haven't experienced any issues since lunch. Oh, wow, you're lucky. There's been quite a lot of issues since lunch. But hopefully most of them should be fixed by this point. Save. Oh my god, I have to go through all my live streams and find all my tech data for all of these submissions. Yeah, that's going to be probably another stream. Something wicked. Okay, that's good. That's good. Most most of the people seem to not have problems. I feel like the most issues people are having are on iPhones because I don't have iPhone. I have a very old iPhone myself and it's kind of buggy. So I can test on like a modern iPhone, but the most of the issues I've seen occur on iPhone. So if you have iPhone, if something doesn't look right or doesn't work right, I would love to hear about it. Because I would definitely need help uh, with that because I don't have an ability to debug it myself very well. For example, quick question. If you're an iPhone, could you could you try something real quick for me? Because Julie reported this issue and I actually could replicate it on my old iPhone. I'm curious if everybody has this issue. So if you're an iPhone, if you go on your homepage and if you try to click on this uh, exclamation, I mean, question mark, does it show uh, the pop-up or does it just freeze the whole website? Because it works fine on every single device, except iPhone. I don't know what's wrong with iPhone. The funny part is, this is this exactly the same code as we have in settings. Like These are exactly the same pop-ups with the same code. But it works fine in the settings screen on the iPhone, but on the homepage it doesn't work on iPhone. I just, I just don't get it. <laughs> I, ca I can't figure out what's, what's causing the issue. <clears throat> I have an iPhone and I have no problem. Okay, that's good. If you not if you want to know what that picture was about, you should read the comments. I'm sorry, Dara. Wait, did you did you the comments Oh, the comments on the... Okay, I'm dumb. Sorry. Wait. I forgot that we have comments. Let's see. Here we go. My gamertag, Elfshine, began as my 12 plus years playing a fire mage in World of Warcraft. I doubt anyone will get the reference, but I thought it was cool. Cool way to pay homage to Elshine's roots. I expect low results due to the obscure reference, but I like the picture. Okay, yeah, I, I, I've never played World of Warcraft, even though I heard a lot of it about it, but I feel like it has a very cool hero vibe, even without knowing the reference. So I don't believe you're going to get super low results. I think there's a good chance it's going to do 
pretty good. The only thing I have problems with using my iPhone is when I want to change the account, it won't let me change it. Really? Uh, can can you message me describing exactly what happens? Like, what what exact issue are you having? Nothing happens when I press on on my iPhone, on an iPad either. Okay, so that makes sense. So there's some kind of iOS issue. I'll have to I have to debug it a little bit more. Okay, let's finish the let's finish the results. Uh just a couple more left. <clears throat> Seventeen five eight two. Cannot wait to see my full amount of moonstones that I've ever made with Dream Snaps. And also translate it into money. You can you can count how much money you can make per month doing Dream Snaps. And I feel like my results are I don't know, they probably are above average, but they're definitely not on the top. Like I know there's people who get consistently high results, so they, they're making even more moonstones. Which is pretty cool. I wonder what my average is. If I were to guess, I'm going to guess right now and then we'll see in the end. My average is about 3,000 Moonstones. That's the guess. I use PC and it logs me out automatically after a few hours. Yeah, that's that's uh, that's an intended behavior. It's like the session duration is two hours. So if you don't do any actions at all on the website for two hours, it's going to log you out just to make f for security purposes. I think a lot of websites do this nowadays. I might actually uh, increase the duration of the session if that's like maybe to 24 hours. Critter love. I just hit 100k moonies. Let's go. Congratulations, Melissa. Oh, this one was really good. The score was pretty high, too. Also, I'm going to get my cup tomorrow. Pretty excited about that. Oh, no. I typed in pixel dust wrong. Unacceptable. Five more left to upload. Come on. Let's do this. Exciting. Oh, that's the wrong result. When is my dreamy bathroom dream snap? That's what I want. I've been getting lots of fancy toilets. I need to use them. By the way, say hi to kitty. Oh! Wrong button. That's the kitty.
By the way, guys, just for fun, I want to try something. I want to I want to try doing a Dream Snap Inspiration video this week on Thursday. I want to try to do it on the Dreamers portal. So let's see how it goes. But we're going to do it for a test. Forget me not. I wonder if it's going to be an easier experience than on the Discord. Yep, very soft kitty. Mm, score. So close. Done. Hi, Sailor. The name of the kitty is Zhir. It means fat in Russian. Aww. Likes the belly pet. Kitty likes his belly pet. Hey! He tried to bite me. Hey, hey, that's not fun. Calm down. I love being able to put all my dream snaps together. Can't wait to be able to see how many others... To see so many others per challenge. Oh, you can do that right now. The, the Dream Snap Gallery, that's exactly what it's for. Oh no, now I showed him intention. Now he's gonna try to climb on my desk. I should have known better. Okay, lie down. This is your bed. Lie down. Lie down. Relax. Daddy is busy. Hey, nope. No. <laughs> yeah, we went from couches to tables. That's true. Two more. Two more left. No! No! Lie down. Lie down. No table. Blocked. Gonna put a water bottle in his way. Okay, guys. We're almost ready to start the storage system. Just need three more minutes. To get this done. Wow, that's my best rank. Yep, this is the best submission I've ever done. Incredible. And the score is so low. This is not my highest score by far. And yet it's the best result. Fascinating. Done. I've never been in top 10. My best result was rank 11. Maybe one day. Oh, no! Go back. How I blocked you. Go back. 
Naughty Cat. Blocking my screens. He wants attention, Dad. I just gave him attention. Now he wants more. Plus, he has attention of so many people right now. Final submission. Boom. Save. It is done. It is done, ladies and gentlemen. Fully finished. Look at this. Fully finished. Every single one of them has been uploaded. Yes. And now let's see what, what my average is. Three. Three thousand. And 88. I nailed it. I was so close to my average. Total Moonstones earned 111,200. Best rank. Worst rank. I still can't believe this is my best submission. Oh, by the way, the new feature, in case you haven't noticed, now you can click a back button on your phone or on the computer when you are inside the photo and it will uh it will just close the picture before I, I i was noticing myself i would open the photo then i would click back on my phone and it would just go back on the whole previous page but now if you're inside a photo it will just close the photo it is pretty but look it doesn't even have foreground the sun is behind me like it's breaking all the rules of dream steps that i have for myself and and yet it did the best so maybe maybe i should just reverse my rules Plus, it was only second week, so I guess the competition wasn't as fierce yet. At least he doesn't drive you crazy by licking a plastic bag. My cat loves doing that. What? How did you know? He does that. He does it. My Both of my cats, they don't just lick plastic bags. They eat plastic bags like i literally saw them inhale a plastic bag they would chew it chew it chew it and it will get inside and then we'll just swallow them and then you can find a plastic bag in their litter box that's the most disgusting thing ever and they not just plastic bags any kind of strings they would eat them and then poop them out and it's gross You have to you have to you have to hide all of the plastic bags otherwise they're going to get eaten. Okay, let's take a look at a couple of random submissions. Let's take a look at the recently added submissions. And then we're going to go do the the thing, the what you call it? The storage system, yeah. Keep forgetting what we're doing today. We have a submission by Christina Prendergast. Villanita is fighting the crime stoppers for the precious bank treasure. Who will win? I'm Tim Villain. <laughs> That's awesome. So I've seen a couple of people do this. They reverse the roles. They have mannequins as heroes and the character is a villain. I think it's genius. I hope people people are not going to say that, okay, you're dressed like a villain. Doesn't count. I feel like it counts because there's still hero outfits in the picture. I think it should definitely count. Speaking of strings, one day I noticed a small piece of yarn on my cat's behind. When I went to take it off... I found that the yarn was not only... Okay, okay, Miss Cupcake. We don't need the details. 
<laughs> oh, by the way, did you see this cool screen? So you can actually open the full details about your dream snap and then you can just click back and it's going to go exactly to the spot where you were. So if you're scrolling a big gallery, you can you can open submission page take a look at all the information then click back and you are not going to lose your spot whatever like whatever settings you you were uh, you had applied it's going to be here so you can just keep browsing i i took this idea from reddit reddit does that when you scroll reddit and then you open the reddit it doesn't go to a whole new page it just opens it in like little pop up oh my god my cat eats everything this cat this cat this cat he can eat everything he loves broccoli literally more than he loves chicken he goes crazy for broccoli and yesterday he ate an olive like he would eat anything oh my god it's me i'm christina no way awesome submission we have briantix Oh yeah, it's very likely that the latest submissions are going to be watching the stream right now because he probably came from the stream. That is cool. I love the close-ups. Wait, so these have a crack on it. So you can make it look like somebody tried to rob the vending machine and you came here to stop it. That's a cool idea. That's a very cool idea. <laughs> I'm sorry, Twinkles. No worries, Sarah. We we just started like an hour ago. Jay Gazmom. It may look like I'm the bad guy, but this man in front of me is clearly a villain. <laughs> oh, wow. He is a villain. You're a pirate superhero. I love this. You're sneaking up on it. That, it does look like you're sneaking up on him ready to attack. That's pretty cool. Oh, we got an ancient aesthetic submission by Briantix. These projectors are so cool. Wow, I'm surprised how dark this photo is, but how... Wait a second. Uh... <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> I I don't think I don't think most people will notice, but since we can zoom in here, we will notice. <laughs> Did Merlin cast a spell on you <laughs> to grow a beard out? I love the lighting on the back. This is so good. Like, this is such a perfect backlighting. It's amazing. I love this. Nicely done, Briantix. Oh, Briantix uploaded a chill summer submission as well. That looks good. Lots of snowballs, too. How much, how well did this do? Oh, 1,500. Hmm. Yeah, a lot of people got robbed this week. Sad. I've never done a mail before. Yeah, I mostly do mail on my second account. But the beard, I feel like it looks pretty cool. Plus gives me extra tags. Marion Reed. Superhero for a day. Oh, wait, did you plan this? Wait, how? Where are these bubbles coming from? I don't see any circle. Is there a circle? This is genius. This looks so cool. Yeah, chill summer was all over the place. That was a weird week. But I don't see the circle. I only see the bubbles. Where Where is the outline of a circle? Which is cool. Like, this actually creates a very unique illusion. I didn't have high hopes for my chill summer submission, but got surprised. 
Yeah, some people got surprised. Some people got surprised not in a good way. Oh, you see it? I guess I'm blind then. Jessica! Is that... That is chill summer, right? Wait, how, how well did this do? Oh, no, wait. This is Critter Love. No results yet. Oh, this is adorable. Man, I love being able to zoom in into Dream Snaps. I'm missing this feature in Discord. Why doesn't Discord allow you to zoom in into photos? At least on, on the desktop version. I think on the mobile you can zoom in. But on desktop, sometimes I just want to get close and personal. Can you look at the whole galleries? Yep, you can you can look at anything right now. We have a dream snap library now fully finished. You can sort it, finish it. If you if you like some if you want to see the whole gallery of a specific person, you can just click on their banner right here and it's going to take it take you to their page and you can take a look at all their work. And soon you'll even be able to follow them. So when they upload something new, you will get a notification so you can easily find it. Lots of features are coming soon, guys. All right. That's enough of the portal for today. The link is in the pinned comment. Go check it out. Uh, yeah, I think it's coming along pretty nicely. And if you find any bugs, please report them. Let's go and do the storage system. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so this is the area. Let's clean it out. My accounts are Melissa H and Melissa H2. <laughs> Both have... One has 38 snaps, one has 28 snaps. Wow, Melissa, you did two full accounts. That's awesome. Tea party raid. Wait, we got raided? Wait, I missed it. Who raided us? Welcome, raiders. How are you guys doing today? Wow, you are really getting this. We're building a storage system today. I've been needing one for a long time. My old one got ruined by the ex expansion. I blame expansion. Welcome, welcome. You could make a QR code for the portal site and keep it in a corner of the stream. Ooh. I like the way you think, Jimmy. I like the way you think. Does any... Do people even use QR codes? Let me know in the comments if you actually use QR codes for things. Because I, I, I don't think I've ever used a QR code for anything. Unless there was literally no other option. Maybe I'm just a boomer, I don't know. Hi, Redhead Mermaid. No worries. It, it was a very nice snap. I hope you get good results. I use QR only when I'm obligated to. Yeah, that's, that's how I feel usually. Like, if I have literally no other choice... I don't know why. I, I it's just. I guess it, it does make. Right now, it's integrated into your camera app, so it does make it easier. Did you play Hogwarts Legacy? I did. I did. I have a whole playthrough on my uh, on my other channel. It's called Lumos. It was a while ago. Well, let me check something. My day old T, thank you so much for the raid. I, I missed the raid notification. I apologize. 
Hope you guys had a good stream. I have to use QR codes to save my dream snaps. Oh, well, yeah, that that is... I feel like if you are... Like, for this particular case, it's the most convenient way. For sure. But, like, if I see a QR code... Let's say I'm watching an ad and they have a QR code... If I'm interested in the ad, I'm, I, I feel like I'm more likely to go uh, in description and find the link or just Google it. But if it's like a, if it's an affiliate link, I, I'll just go in description to find the link. I, I don't think my first uh, instinct would be to use the QR code. But I wonder why, because that's so convenient, such, such a cool technology. Maybe I should start using it more. I feel like they should they just make it easier for some things so I will use them. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's a good idea for Disney Dreamlight Valley. I wonder why don't they do for all the platforms to be able to share your image with QR code. I feel like a lot of people would would use it if it was an option. I don't think Switch or PlayStation has has an option, right? It's only PC and Xbox. All right, let's cover this giant area. This is my storage system. Oh, this time, I'm not going for any fancy golden bricks. We're going for nice and simple sun-baked earth. Blends pretty well with uh, the color of the earth in Sunlit Plateau. The random shadow is kind of kind of bothers me a little. Perfect. Fully blended. That's going to be a giant area. I want to have like full-blown waterfalls, crazy lights, lots of chests, everything. And this time I'm actually going to use uh, tables with with items on them to showcase what's inside there. And maybe I'll craft a bunch of those... <gasps> Wait, I want to craft a bunch of those uh, ancient-looking market thingies. I feel like they're going to fit the vibe so well. Okay, I think this is enough for now. That's a decent area. Okay. Woo! Market. The stalls. Yep, that yep, that's the word I was looking for. Oh, the switch has the code as well. Inside Distant Dreamlight Valley, not inside, uh, like, Switch Gallery. But you still have to get the stuff from Eternity Isle to these chests. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have a teleporter, like, in the middle of it. Okay, let's, let's just design the whole area. I'm gonna determine the size right now, and I'm gonna put, uh, I'm gonna make it... I think I want to go, I want it to go all the way here. So this is going to be the entrance. So I'm just going to move it all the way to the top. And then later, if I need to remove some of this, I'll take it off. But this is going to mark basically my boundaries. This is going to be a little storage oasis. We can have Scar, Bride Rock around, all the good stuff. We can add it later. I'm running out of, <laughs> of this material. I mean, it's pretty cheap to craft. I think it's the cheapest one. It, it just uses 
dirt and maybe pebbles. I'm not sure about pebbles though. Okay, so I want to have like a nice entrance. Maybe I'll add some decoration. So I think this is enough. Okay. This is the area. So I want to have a teleporter in the middle. So if I teleport to Sunlit Plateau, I'm most likely coming to my storage system. So we're going to put it right here. Right in the middle. Good. Done. Perfect. DDV needs the ability to add terrain as a grid with options to increase and decrease size. Oh, please, yes. To be able to fill an area with a floor, that would be so good. Barren wasteland. That's what most people will see here. I see potential. Lots of potential. All right, let's bring, let's bring everything. Let's bring Moana's boat. Those are the big items that are going to need to be positioned first. I, I kind of want to have a little bit of a potentially like maybe a lake or a pond close to what can I place here? Let's see. I don't want to look at too out of place. I think if I go to Moana, I'll find some good items. Maybe I use the circular cir circular rocky pool. Oh, <gasps> maybe I use the waterfall. Wait a second, let me see the waterfall. Why is the music not playing? Yeah, guess we're gonna play Stardew. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dara. I hope you feel better. I fully, for I always forget Sound of the Plateau exists. I kind of agree with this. That's why I'm doing my storage system here because I don't see myself building like a lot of stuff here. That's why I feel like it's going to be easy to, uh, like other places I have so many plans for, but not Sound of the Plateau. Also, I want to kind of have like surround this area with something to give it like a little nice little boundary i feel like i want to use a bunch of these uh some waterfalls obviously i'm definitely stealing this i completely forgot who i i did a valley tour somebody had a whole wall of waterfalls here was it dreamlight decorista i feel like it was but that looked good, and it makes sense. Let's just place all of these waterfalls here. We'll figure out the exact location in a second. Wasn't it Enigma? Honestly? I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. I did so many valley tours. Yeah, the waterfall does look good in this area. I also want to have some of these bamboo things, the trees. Like I want it to be interspersed. Maybe a couple of these. I definitely want to put it in the corner, though. I think this looks pretty good. Oh boy, I can't put anything here. Well, maybe I'll just have a little opening. Who knows? Hmm. 
Not a big fan of these shadows, but I do. I am a big fan of how this looks, though. Yeah, this is going to take some figuring out for sure. I think I can add some lights there to make it look good. My valley's not decorated, it's super messy. Yep, same here. Same here. Hmm. Yeah, actually, I'm not a huge fan of how this looks in the corner. I'm going to focus on design so much more than the actual... Uh, than the actual storage system. We're probably not even going to start placing chests today. That's so weird how... Oh man, I wish we could intersect this better, but oh well. Yeah, I don't know if I like the spawn here, to be honest. We'll see. This is not a bad idea, actually. To have little blocks like this. Ooh. Ho ho. Don't mind if I do. The bamboo goes well with Sunlit Plateau. Yeah, one thing I don't like about bamboo is the fact that it blocks half of it. 
Like, it, it blocks way too much. You can put stuff inside waterfalls, kinda. Ooh, this is cool. Kinda helps cover up the corners. Ooh, I love this. My daughter and I stopped playing DDV and just started back again, so we missed out on Star Pass. Ooh, that's sad. There's that was a lot of cool items. You could use the tangled pill. I don't think I, I'll be able to place it there. I was thinking about that. I can also p place some torches around for some lights, but we're going to figure out the lighting later. Okay, let me figure this out again. kind of like surrounding these things with waterfalls. This way I don't have to block the entire thing. I can have a couple of these. So if I have like a corner like this with waterfalls... Something like this. Yeah, I wish I could... I think I might be able to place... I mean, yeah, I can definitely place uh, the torch right here and here. Hmm. Yeah, this pillar is not exactly blocking anything. Are you doing a video on the rumored next to Dream Snaps themes? I don't think so. I don't think it gives you any advantage knowing the themes in advance because you don't even know the tags. You only know the theme. Plus, it's just I don't know, not not enough content for a video. I feel like if we had like a whole month, uh, like a whole I don't know, like all every single Dream Snap theme until the next update. That would make sense. Isn't it crazy how you can place items inside the waterfall? But you can't place them like on this one little square to the side. This is like, this is crazy. So you can have item inside of it, but not on the edge of it. <laughs> Brilliant! Your cat's pattern is stunning. Well, here's her name. His name is Jir. He's a pretty kitty. Kitty, you just got a compliment. You have a stunning pattern. Ooh, I don't... Maybe it's too big. Uh... I don't hate how this thing looks.
Okay, wait a second. Let's try something. Yeah, this is this is going to take a while, guys. You thought it was going to be a simple storage system. But you should have known. There's no such thing as simple in Disney Dreamlight Valley. No, it's one square. Oh, no, it doesn't fit one square. Okay, two squares. It doesn't fit two squares. Okay, what if we do it like a corner piece? Let's try this. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, here we go. Okay, this actually looks good. To have these little nature clusters in the middle here. Huh. What do you think? You can have a little bit of uh, stalls in here. A little bit of stalls in here. Chests in here for fish. Oh, yeah. I like it. Do you think this looks better with palm trees or with uh, with the plants? Let me show you the palm trees. What looks better? The palm tree? Or the, the, the little plants? That looks pretty good. Palm tree. Yeah, I heard. I heard about the Moana theme. Yeah, that's cool. I kind of like the theme. Oh, like this. When it, like, go goes into it. Boom. Oh, yeah. And I, and I can still place these, like close to it. Maybe not this one, maybe the other one. Both, honestly. Yeah, we're gonna do both. That's a good idea. We're gonna make it look a little bit more green on the bottom using this one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the good stuff. That's a bit dull. I mean, it is a desert. I I'm going to add some, uh, some lights in here, too. It shouldn't, it shouldn't look too dull for long.
I want Hey Hey the chicken. Absolutely. I want him too. Or her. I'm not sure. Now we need a nice bench. Uh, wrong category. This. Or fallen log. Which one is better? Feeling the log makes more sense. Oh, you cannot even place this. Why are you dancing? What is this? What is happening here? Hop! Why are you doing this? Just trying to place you down. Oh, come on. This is not even funny. does that to me too it's so annoying the plant has disco fever well how am i supposed to place it <laughs> Hop. oh god just need to go like on the, on the top down view and even still Oh, this looks good. This looks good. He has ants in his plants. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. And accurate. Doesn't let you place, place grass on top of the floor. What a discrimination against grass. Wait, really? Oh, that's, that's a scam. That's what it is. Oh, well. Thankfully... We have a bunch of stuff that can be placed. Never mind, we don't have. Who makes decisions? What can be placed like that or, or what can't? Wrong place. It's like playing a lottery. If you get the right spots, you win. Up. Okay, I think this looks pretty good. Nice little area to chill. Okay, now... I guess I'll do the same thing here. I just need to buy another one of these benches. No! It got broke. The great grass scam of 2024. That's exactly what it was. Absolute scam. Oh, this is going to look so good during the night. Oh, this is going to look so good during the night. Hmm. 
This tree didn't do nothing wrong. You inspired me to do better with my decorating. Thank you, I appreciate it. Alright, let's turn it on. I mean, let's turn on the night. Just for fun. Okay, we can definitely use a, a bit more lighting here. I'm gonna have to craft a bunch of these torches. Yeah, we're going to need lots of lighting here. Wait, what? That's not what I meant to do. Well, up, oh, up. And my favorite... I mean, I guess I can put some candles in the grass, too. It's going to look good. Ooh, these things, though, look pretty good, too. Next time, just press undo. Yeah, I keep forgetting that we have undo option. This looks good. I've got your back. Okay, now I need to do one more like this on the right there, and we're gonna be set. I did a build kind of like this when I made the safari restaurant. That is not a bad idea. I, w I was very considering very much to bring Remy in there so I can buy ingredients and then just put stuff straight in the chest. But I feel like it would his building suits to the city build so much, so I'm going to keep him for the city build. This place really shows that everybody Have you done a new storage and the Dreamer's Portal yet? Uh, we did the Dreamer's Portal. I'm uh, working on the storage right now. You, it might have, it might not be obvious, but I was just building my storage. Uh, but I need it to look good, though. I need my storage to, to look good. So we're building some decorations around it too. Uh, okay, I needed to to order some more of these benches. I'll order a couple of these just in case I want to place them around. Wait, I have 27 of these. What? Where, where was I looking? I thought I saw only saw one. Bye-bye, Scroogey boy. Let's craft a bunch of torches. I should have the resources.
fiber. Fiber. Didn't think I would see the day when I actually need fiber. I guess I never had to craft a lot of torches. Okay, 38 torches should be enough for me. Let's make like 30 of big ones. <laughs> Scrooge did that so you would spend more money. Yeah, Scrooge does stuff like that. Let's build a couple of these two. Eight small ones. And I also wanted to make... What did I want to make? Ooh, I kind of want to have sand fountain in there. Oh, that's going to look good in my storage system. Also, these things are going to look good. All of these things are going to look good. I, oh, oh, yeah, I needed to craft a bunch of these. Tropical wood floor. Yeah, I don't have much right now. But I'll have to grind. And I need to craft all of these stalls now. Wait, don't tell me the stalls also need tropical wood. Wow. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. All right, let's go grind tropical wood. <laughs> I should should be able to get a lot from Eternity Isle. I have chests in each biome, one for herbs, one for flowers, and then the one that is connected to each other. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's that's smart. That's smart. One wood. How quaint. All right, I need uh I need the Oh, here it is. Let's collect a bunch of stuff. Give me all of your tropical Wait, excuse you? No tropical wood? What a scam. Wait, I already have one here. Uh... I am not who I used to be. Whoa, these are those, these are the same plants as we have, just much bigger. Did you notice this? So why can't the game enlarge these, but we can't? I want to have those giant ones to stick them everywhere, too. Wow, they're literally using the same items. And stick them into the walls and enlarge them. I, I didn't even notice until now. Well played, Disney Dreamlight Valley. Well played. Yeah, this is going to be a while to collect all of this uh, tropical wood for sure. Going to have to grind this off camera for the next stream. As soon as he yawns, I start yawning. I need oxygen. Let me turn on the fan, maybe it will help. Look, every single item that's in the walls is one of the plants that we already have just enlarged and stuck into the wall. 
Except these, I'm not sure we have these. Oh, now I can't stop! Yep. Giant plants. You're welcome, Sarah. Yeah, that was that was news to me as well. Okay, let's build let's build this one now. So I'll place one of these inside. Something like this. Whoa. Like, this inconsistency drives me crazy. Some trees can be placed on top of the path. Some trees can't. Like, what makes some trees special? Oh, man, what is happening? Whew! Where did all the oxygen go? Seating. Put a bench right here. I guess I won't be able to recreate it exactly because it's slightly different width, but I'll try to get it close. Definitely want to have the cactuses around me like this. Yeah, right now the time of day is not the prettiest to see this area, to be fair, but that's all we got. Wait, was it? I can't, I, I don't get it. I mean, I guess it's fine. Something is not symmetrical though, but I can't I can't put my finger what exactly. I feel like the whole bench needs to move one square to the right, otherwise things are not going to work out. <laughs> what is wrong with you, cactus? Relax! Relax, everything is okay. Mr. Star is spiraling again. I know, right? It's not even dream snaps. I don't know what's going on.
Do, do I need to move it one more square? No, I don't think so. Okay, something like this. Close enough. Let's place let's place the lighting. Boom. Boom. Ooh, these these could look pretty good in here too. Some lion cubs in the in the midst of stuff. And a couple of short torches. And I think we're going to be doing just fine. And of course it doesn't fit. Okay, you know what? Let's move the pubs a little bit to the right. In this spot. And we'll put the torches right here. Okay, good. And now the big torches. And maybe we'll even place a couple chests in the storage system today. Who knows? Nobody knows. I might still spiral. Ah! Wait, how did I place it? Oh, I just placed it on the side here. Okay, some like this. Done. I think you already are. Ah. Uh. Hi, Debbie. Uh, you didn't miss much. Just the biggest feature ever released in Dreamers Portal. And we're doing a storage system, which so far doesn't have any storage yet, but it will. It definitely will. Okay, I, I actually want to craft the stalls now. Let's do one red, and of course I'm out of mechanical parts. That makes sense. I think one of them actually does not allow you to does not allow you to place items under it, I think. Which is dumb because it's a stall. Let's see if it's the red one. I hope not because the red one will fit my design much more. How am I supposed to find it? I don't think I can find it. Oh, I have four of them already. Oh. Well, that's convenient. I mean, I don't know what, what the small stalls are going to be for. Yeah, that's a good point. Could have just found it on the red. But what would be a fun in that? All right, let's see if we can put chests under this. Uh, I would probably put my stones in here. Oh, yes, you can. 
Let's go. So yeah, this would be my jam, my mining stuff basically in here. There's going to be a lot of mining chests because we have now a bunch of stuff from two biomes. We'll have to reorganize this. Five chests. I think five for all the gems and all the mineables is probably not enough, actually. What if we put them sideways? Can I do six? I also want to have... Uh, I want to have a table behind each so I can place a bunch of items to showcase what it is. Something that fits the vibe. We know him so well. Wait, what? What did, what did you say? What happened? No one believe when you say quick and simple in a sentence. Did I ever say quick and simple about the storage system? I was pretty confident that it was going to be a very difficult and very time-consuming task. So I don't feel like I don't feel like I misled you in any way, shape or form. And I'm not going to be able to find the proper table for this. Oh, I found a proper table for this. So let's say if I have a uh, this and this in two rows, will it work? Like this, like this. No, 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 I don't like it. I don't want it to look too busy. That's why I chose a giant area so I can have enough space for it. I'm, I'm just gonna put a couple chests to the sides here because we have some space to the sides. This is going to be my mining area. I decided. I'm pretty sure the word simple was used. Well, then I, I misspoke. I never intended for this to be simple. Do I have any more of these simple tables? How do I even find it? Oh, that's a good one as well. Though the other one fits the style a little bit more. Ooh, this one is 4x4. Four four. And it's also 4. Ooh la la. You only have one. No! I'm looking for something to put in the middle. Two by two. I need two by two that has two squares on top. And it looks... No, that, that, that has one square on top. Is there even something two by two with two squares on top? Buy more. That one I'm pretty sure is craftable. I have to craft more. Coffee table, okay. Do we have a square coffee table? Side table. This one only has one. Oh, this. But, yeah, with a... Without the, the thing. Cabinets. Yeah, but I needed to match the other table. I feel like there has to be something. I'm like so confident. Is there really nothing?
Like, coffee table is good. I guess I could put one like this sideways. I guess it's not gonna kill. Yeah, I guess I, I'll have to do this. I don't think there's any other option. I'll just have to put one two by three sideways. Yeah, it doesn't exactly match. No, it doesn't even much match the height. Come on. Is that the best we got? Ooh. I love the Wanderer table. I mean, at this point, I might as well put... Ooh, the Wanderer table is clean. Look at that. But I don't like the metal part, though. Okay, I decided. I'm just gonna craft a bunch of these tables. And I hope I have ingredients for them. Yeah, we got if I, I'm probably gonna use it for the entire setup, so I'm gonna need like 48. Okay, let's do like 20 for now. I'm definitely gonna need 20. Ooh, this is gonna look good. That one, the, pi the painted wood one, I love it. Yeah, I think I want to go for the for the simple one so it doesn't distract with the stuff on it. But yeah, these these crafting tables, crafted tables are really good. Now the question, how do I find it again? I'm just gonna when when I find it, I put a bunch of them outside, so I don't have to look for them all the time. Okay, so I guess I'll just, I'll put the one in the middle like this, and I'll just put some items on it. It's fine. Okay, so I'm going to need five. Wait, let's see. Is five even enough? Maybe five is enough. Yeah, this looks pretty good. This looks pretty good. Yeah, this is going to be a multi multi stream project, guys. This is for sure. I want to have something on the back. Oh, I know exactly what to put there. No, actually, I have no idea. I was thinking maybe these... Wait, where did they go? The branch partition, I just had him. I just had him in my inventory. I am furious. I, ha I saw them today in my inventory and I didn't use them. I guess I can just use these for now. Kind of looks pretty good too. I'll steal one from here. Oh no. This is more important. Oh no. 
Never mind, it doesn't even fit there. Come on. Yeah, this kind of looks weird. Okay, let's actually put put the stuff that's going to be in there. So let's start with the gem. So I have one. Oh, this one is empty. Oh, I kind of have a bunch of garbage in here. Two, two chests for gems right now. I'm going to need three. Another gem for Eternity Isle. So three for gems. One for stone coal, another one for mineable stuff. So five is actually enough, I think, for the mining stuff. Okay, so we're going to place the, the gem ones in the middle. So I'm going to get uh, one of each color so I can place them. One of these, and we're going to have to organize this too. One of these, one of these... One of these. And one opal. I mean, this one. Ooh, five. I'm not going to be able to fit five in there. Ooh. Okay, I see what we, we what we have to do. No, actually, I don't see. Is there a chance I can put four gems in each? How many gems in total do we have? I've got five chests just for gems. Yeah, I know. I'm starting to think it might not be enough. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven, twelve. Twelve. So I could technically have three gem chests. But this is doesn't this doesn't even include the eternity isle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Eighteen! Oh boy. And we're going to need even more in the future for the next expansions. Okay, I know what to do. There's only one option. We have to put six gems per chest. I think it's going to be enough. We're going to have to move everything forward one, one step. Even more forward. And just put the tables behind like this. So I can have six gems on every single one of them. Oh my god. <laughs> this is going to be fun. Wait a second. So if I need six, I might actually use a different table for this. I might actually use those coffee tables. Because they, they have exactly six and they're lower, so that might, might look better. Some of the gems are available in both. Yeah, but they're still, like, there's totally 18 different gems. Plus shiny variation of each. So three chests... Six in each. Potentially, I could expand it later in the future.
Is there li really nothing better looking for to be a two by three? Ooh. Oh, hello there, Mr. Island Coffee Table. Oh, we just found a jackpot. Yep, we're doing the storage system. Well, just the mining part of it, because there's gonna be there's gonna be a lot of chests in this whole area. This is gonna be my market slash storage system. Okay. So six chests we got with six items in each chest. Oh, that looks good. Look how flush it is as well. Oh yeah. So let's switch these around. And then we'll switch these around. Drop, 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 drop. And I'll need to add another gem to there. To make it... To make it six. I guess we'll do the orange ones. Or... No, wait. I definitely want to split them by the biomes. I guess I'll get uh, Garnet. Yeah, I don't think I will ever grind more gems than I have right now, so I think it will be fine. Wait, why do I have a shiny diamond here? That's not... That's not what I wanted. No! I wanted a regular diamond. Wait, what? Is the regular diamond so big? Huh. I didn't realize the regular diamonds are so much bigger. Hi, Julie. So we're going to have Eternity Isle gems. Uh, I mean, Eternity Isle... Yeah, that's what I said. In this chest. Which is going to be... Okay, let's, let's first deal with these ones. Then how big is the shiny? I... I don't I don't want to know. <laughs> you know what? Some of these Okay, the, my current organization of the gems doesn't make sense. I'm going to reorganize them completely. I want to make a little bit more sense. One, two, three, four, five. There should be one more. Which color am I missing? From from regular island, I'm missing one gem. Am I missing one gem? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, I'm definitely missing one gem. Which one? Made it from cheapest to most expensive. I don't even know how much they cost. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12... Oh yeah, I'm missing uh, the sapphire. You're right. Wait, am I completely out of sapphires? Oh no, here they are. Wait, how did I miss it?
You just add them to your inventory and then press R. Oh. Yeah, that's a good point. I think I wanna I wanna do it so uh like by shape. There's a couple gems that are the same shape. Like these one, two, three, four, five, and a diamond. So the square ones go to one chest and the round ones go to the other chest. I think it makes more sense. Okay, let's do this. Okay, like this. Yeah, it looks kind of... Kind of makes sense. Not by color. I mean, I don't know. It's, it's, it's hard. I honestly don't know. Wait a second. Uh-oh. This is the same gem. Wait, am I missing another one again? What am I... <laughs> what am I missing? Come on. Oh, boy. Okay, guys, you have a trained eye. Which one am I missing? Looking like infinity stones. Yeah, it looks pretty sick. This one is different one. Garnet. There is one. Oh, is that my screen being stupid again? They look identical on my screen. Yeah, but when I look at my other screen, they look different. Wow. I need to calibrate this stupid monitor. Yeah, they... Wow, that's crazy. They look absolutely identical of one of my screens. Come on. That's crazy. Okay. And now we're going to do the Eternity Isle gems, which is also six. One. Two. Three. Four. Oh, don't tell me I'm missing one. Five. Which one am I missing? Oh, no, I don't. I have this. Wait, this is shiny. I used all my regular blue zircone on stupid tiles. I'm gonna have to go farm some. So I can put it in the chest. I forgot where it is. Lagoon. Here we go. You added two of the same. I'm, I'm still missing Zircon, though. There we go. There's some Zircon. I need at least two. One to put on the shelf and one to put in the chest. Oh, come on. You give me shiny ones? Seriously? Do you have the jade? Wait a second. If there is also a jade. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, yeah, the jade. Yeah, I still. I think I have a jade in one of the chests. I have to. I need. Come on, I need at least one of the zircon. Oh! Please don't be shiny. Please don't be shiny. Okay. I mean, two would be better. Let's 
two would be better, but I'll take it. Yeah, once my storage system is fully complete, we're gonna dedicate the whole stream when I'm I'm just running around Eternity Isle and collecting all of the stuff possible. And putting them in my chests. I just realized, is the member counter broken? What happened here? Are we at zero members? Oh, here we go. <laughs> Weird glitch. I must have jade in one of these chests. If I if I didn't have it in the other chest. Look at all this mess that we need to sort out. Oh my god, we're gonna have so many chests for time bending as well. I have to have Jade. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. Don't make me go farm Jade now. It wasn't in this chest? Oh no, it was. I just forgot to take it. Never mind. Wait, is there a shiny jade? Because I don't think I ever had shiny jade before. Okay. Let's drop it. Drop. Drop. Yeah, it's, I like Eternity Isle gems because they all look so different. Look at this. That's so pretty. You better unload for now. Yeah, we're going to unload all of the gems for sure. And of course, one of them had to be bigger than the others. That makes so much sense. I guess I like this angle the most. Ooh, this one is pretty. This one is very pretty. I think I need to switch these because this one is blocking everything. Okay. Now let's sort it out. Let's make sure all of the gems go in the right chests. We're going to start with this one. Like this. And six is going to make six rows. So it's going to be very pretty. I guess inside we can sort it out by by color oh wait these don't even go here damn it oh yeah you can just right click to transfer I keep forgetting that's such a cool feature yeah just right click boom 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 Everything that's not square goes here. This is going to be much easier in the future to sort it by shape. Definitely much easier. Let's put all of this here. Let's take all the square from here. Because it's immediately obvious which, which chest they, they're supposed to go to. Yeah, I'm going to have to go on a mining spree for everything that I'm missing, which is mostly Eternity Isle gems, because I I just didn't have much time to mine them yet. All right, let's sort this. Oh, wait, I forgot the black ones. Just press T. Yeah, but if I need to transfer from the chest, it's not going to work. Ooh, this one is... This chest is almost full, actually. That's kind of cool. Uh, all right, let's start with... Oh, there is no shiny onyx, I guess. This is going to be tough to sort it. Okay, let, let me move some stuff in my inventory for now. 
So we have more space to sort it. Like this. Ooh, I have a lot of onyx. I might just sell the extra. Or I can craft it into the, the dark shards, I guess. Oh no, never mind. I forgot to take these out. Oh my. Okay, that, never mind. There's not the, as much as I thought. Okay. <laughs> this is crazy. Like this. Then we're going to have the red. Then we're going to have the green. Then we're going to have the yellow. Oh yeah, my topaz. I hate topaz. It's the difficult, the most difficult one to get. Oh wow, have a lot of uh, Vitalis Mines crystals. Doesn't this feel satisfying? Look at this. Oh yeah. <laughs> you need Onyx for potions. I am? You're missing spinel, not amber. Wait, we're gonna get to the chest in a second. Let me Let me figure these chests out first. I guess we'll start with red. No, we're going to start with this. Yeah, these ones I used a lot to craft all of that path for my park. That is now four times cheaper to craft. That I'm still salty about that. Well, not even four. I think it's even more than four times cheaper. Did not mean to put zircon here. Where is all my aqua? Oh, <laughs> never mind. Yeah, I don't know if it makes much sense, but oh well. Oh man, this is satisfying. Oh yeah. Guys, are you satisfied? Look completely different on mine. This is hurting my brain just watching. Wait, what happens? Why? Why does it hurt your brain? I thought this was supposed to be satisfying. Mary, thank you so much for $10 super chat with a bunch of question marks. Wait, why didn't it show up in the chat? Am I blind? That's so strange. Oh, this is the tip from the from the stream labs. Thank you so much, Mary. Yeah, that's from that's that's from the stream labs. This is not through super chat. Let's play it again. And let's play some kitties as well. Thank you so much. Lots of kitties on the screen. Everybody's dancing. Dance, kitty, dance. Good. Yeah, got to start somewhere. Guys, by the time we're over, you're going to be very satisfied. I can promise you that. 
Okay, now let, let me grab all of these gems. We're also going to need chests for all the crystals, for, for all the shards. I mean, we do have chests for this, I guess. Like, I have a bunch of stuff in here that doesn't even need to be here. Okay. Let's start with the fancy one, like this. Then we go for this. Then we go for this. And this. Now this. Yeah, this chest needs filling, guys. Wait a second. No! There is seven? Oh, you got to be kidding me. Why do we have a bunch of red gems? Like, how does it look different from Ruby? Wait, how did I count? I counted 18. Am I really that bad at math? Eternity Isle. Gems. Two, three, four, five. Six. Wait, amber is not a gem? Oh, the amber is a dog for item. Okay, makes sense. Makes sense. I didn't even know. I didn't realize where it comes from. So then we're gonna do this and we're gonna drop one of these spinels. It looks like a wait. How is jade a jam, but amber is not? It's they literally look identical, just different colors. That's kind of crazy. Also, oh, that's Ma Mary. I we see her in the chat. You're welcome. Wanted you to get all of it. Thank you so much, Mary. Yeah, the the streamlabs donations, YouTube doesn't doesn't get the cut from those. The downside, though, it doesn't show up in uh, in the chat because it's from external service. Okay. Done. Let's organize this chest. Let's do it like this. Okay. For now, it's organized. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have more chests that have, like, diggable items as well on the sides here, probably. Because I, I, I want this area to be fully for, for digging stuff. Because we're going to need a lot of space. Oh, this is going to be trouble. Amber is organic jam as pearl. Oh! No, I'm just saying they, they kind of look very similar to jade, but okay. Jade also looks like a stone, doesn't look like a gem. Wait, is jade a gem? Am I crazy? Wait, what is happening? No, jade is a gem. Okay. <laughs> I'm being very confused right now. So far, I like this stall. Yeah, this stall is awesome. I want to add some light on the back so you could always see uh, exactly what you what you put in there. I think this should be able to shine some light on the things. Let's see how this looks during the night. 
But if I decide to do my storage during the night... Oh, yeah. Look at these gems shining bright. Yeah, this is kind of cool. Okay, I'm satisfied. All right, let's continue. So now we got to do... Uh... Oh, there's more spinel here. I guess we're going to do like gold, iron, uh, zinc, all the ores, basically. Uh, it's already kind of organized. Let's do this. Let's do this. Should I do just the bars? I feel like the bars look more interesting than the ores. I'm just going to do the bars. Because we're going to have both bars and non-bars in there, but I feel like it's pretty obvious what this chest is for anyway. This, this, this. But the bars look pretty similar, so I don't know. Anyway. Four bars, and I think we have... I'm missing zinc bar, I think. I should have it. Here we go. No, wait. Wait, do we have zinc bars or not? We use zinc to make bra br br brus, right? Or tin. I don't think we have tin and zinc bars. So I'm just going to have these separate. Okay, six items. Perfect. Drop, 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 drop. Drop, drop. Well, that's not what I meant. Wait, how was how was I splitting stuff and yet ended up with a billion things? Drop. Drop. Okay. That's going to be a good looking chest. Things by buying make sense to me, but crafting the colored chests is so much easier. I agree. I agree. I I I wish when I did my first storage system and crafted all of these chests, we didn't even have colored chests yet, so now I'm stuck with this. Unless I want to drop more dream light. Which I don't. So definitely all the chests I craft from now on are going to be uh are going to be colored, but I still I still have a bunch of non colored ones. Okay, looking good. This is gonna have all the ores. Let's organize this a little bit. Uh, let's start with gold. Oof, I have way too much gold. I don't think I'll ever have to mine for gold. There's nothing to use the gold on. That's the problem. Oof, what? Does anybody need gold? <laughs> That's that's disgusting amount of gold. And one iron ingot. <laughs> look at look at my iron storage compared to gold. That's hilarious. Okay, yeah, we'll just split it up like this, I guess. I don't have much of the other ones anyway. Gold path. Yeah, that's true. I guess I can just craft a ginormous gold gold field. Turn the whole biome into gold or something crazy. Okay, and the final chest is going to be pretty simple. It's just going to be... Uh, 
I guess I'll put these crystals in there because I don't know what else to put it. I want to fully finish mining stuff. This crystal. This crystal. Uh, coal and stone. I'll have to transfer all of this because this chest is filthy. Mm, I transferred too much. Split one. Split one. These are not going to be my main chest for stone and cold, but just the ones where I can drop things off that I randomly pick up. But I will have my 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 coal chest is probably going to be near Kristoff. Oh wait, Kristoff has to move here too. Yeah, we we gotta we gotta move Kristoff in this area too. I turned a big part of my plaza into gold path. With all that gold, I can definitely turn my whole plaza into gold. There's nothing else that you can get from mining, right? I'm not missing anything. Just just stone, gold, vitalis crystals. I'm pretty sure that's all of it. Let me let me find the stone. How do I not have stone in my inventory? That's kind of crazy. keep finding a bunch of random stuff there has to be stone somewhere yeah this is this all will have to get organized i have a bunch of random stuff oh here's stone uh we will do valley visits in a bit i'll have to I just want to finish some stuff on the Dreamer's portal first before I can go back into doing Dreamer uh, stream. What am I talking about? Uh, valley, va valley tours. No problem, Travis. Okay. Perfect. Good morning. Transfer this, this. <laughs> Mike is doing his routine in there. Oh boy, I can't even fit everything. So if you came from mining session, these five chests, boom, we're gonna fill them up easily. As usual, Linus's do all the work. They do? And two rows for stone and for coal because there's going to be a lot of them. Okay. The mining chests are done. I think I'll put digging like around the mining. Let's see if we can if we can organize this. Hi Kit Kat. Hi Ines, welcome. I think my digging chests, these are my digging chests. Oh, these boring, boring one color chests. Maybe one day I'll be swimming in Dreamlight and I'll be able to redecorate completely. Yeah, actually, now I'm thinking we're going to need much more digging chests. I feel like we're going to need a whole another... Yeah, this is not this is not feasible. We're going to need we're going to need at least 4. Let's see how many how many chests we're going to need. I already have 3. I already have three mining chests. 
What are you doing today? Uh, we did some Dreamer Portal review. There's a huge new feature introduced. The Dream Snap Gallery and also building a storage system. Sand. Okay, let's see. First of all, let's go into the collection to see how many items in total I have for, from digging. Collection. All areas. I don't even know where... Crafting? Oh, and also crafted stuff. All of this will need chests somehow as well. I don't even know how. It's so hard to organize things. Okay, but let's start with the basics first. The basic stuff that you dig up. How do I find that? Is it foraging? Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four. Well, this one... Wait, why is coal in here? One, two, three... Four, five, six, seven, eight. I guess I'll put scales there too. Nine, ten. Ten items in total. I think we need at least four chests for this, to be honest. I'm glad you like it, Ines. Meeting someone like you gives me hope. Plastic is from fishing. Yeah, but it kind of makes sense to have with stuff like... I don't know. I guess, yeah, I guess it doesn't make sense to put it here. Okay, let me check the... Yeah, I think we're going to have to do this the next stream, guys. I think I think I have enough organizing for today. I just want to see how the small uh, stall looks. How many chests can I put under it? Maybe I can fit two of these here. I should have built the storage part first and then decorate around it. Now I have to build it around decorations. Oh, this one you can't even put chests on. So this is not going to be... This is not going to make sense. But maybe I can maybe I can fit one. Okay, let me try something. I, I just want to try something real quick. If I put one all the way here, will I be able to put one more vertically? Or like this. Oh yeah, these can actually intersect. Wait, what? So I could have something like this to have like a mining corner. And here maybe I can even build some kind of a wall. Maybe I can put the the wine wall. Or like this. Nah. Does this make any sense? You can use the stone wall. Oh, those ruins? 
Will it make sense here? Does it really make sense here? Ooh, that can go very deep, actually. Kind of like that. Okay, I kind of like this. Something like this. I don't know. Here can be some decoration, some trees. I kind of like this is like a whole separate area. Digging and mining can all fit here. Yeah, you know what? I think that will work. Because I don't want my storage system to take a whole biome, you know? You can add some plants around. Oh, yeah! That's, that's actually a very nice idea. I can, I can even use these things. I think this looks pretty sick. I mean, yeah, we're definitely going to add some plants for like for decoration around. Oh, these things are awesome to just have, like, a nice little... Oh, baby. Oh my. Okay, okay, I dig that. Nice little storage area here. You can even sit, sit and relax here. If I put the bench the right way. <laughs> there we go. Oh yeah, I forgot the glitch. If you put the bench on top of the leaf rug, it doesn't work. Hope they fix it someday. Yeah, this looking good. Can have a nice little open area here where the teleporter comes and then have a bunch of storage around as well. Wow, this is going to be the my best storage system. Well, to be fair, it's only going to be the second storage system, but it can definitely get become the best one. All right, guys, this is all I got for, for today. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the live stream and don't forget to upload all of your dream snaps to Dreamers Portal. Because now we have a one place where everybody can see it. So yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you so much for all the love and support. I'll see you in the next one. And take care.